so this is my review of my turn no real battles for uh, no big battles for the uh, British again <laughs> there's basically no combat this time uh, there is one uh, so what do I purchase um, so reviewing uh, the Germans are about to take Moscow and I am conceding that uh, we did uh, and then uh, there's a stronghold in the middle by the British and uh, and a good line of supply I don't think I grabbed that no I did I did I did all right let's see what happens what do I do? Okay, looking in the right panel over there to the right. Let's see if I can do this zoom feature. I was talking about a zoom feature. Function 9. Uh, 9. I don't know. Control 9. Oh, okay. Anyways. Uh, I was seeing a screen. I'm using ice cream screen recorder, and I'm gonna go down there real quick. Uh, make sure I'm on, and we're recording. Yes. Okay. So, um, uh, what are we doing? We are right panel right there. Oops. Sorry. Uh, in the right panel, you can see that. Uh, I gotta expand that. Okay. Expand my combat moves. Expand these. Battle. Expand the non-coms. Place units. Turn unit completes. Place units start with that. And turn complete. Okay, so here we go. Uh, what are we doing? Okay, so uh, we purchased six infantry. No, eight infantry. Uh, one mech, one sub, and one minor factory. And for Calcutta, uh, one infantry, two mech. Let's see. Let's confirm the money. The money was, so that would be 824, uh, 29, uh, uh, 31, uh, 41, 47, uh, I think is the math. 24 plus 6 is 30, 42, and... 46 46 dollars okay here we go and then for that would be um three and eight is 11 11 i have malaya okay uh units repaired i repaired my battleship because i put an 81 so that's sweet okay so i thought about doing a raid on ukraine but i am in the lead right now i think so i'm not going to throw away those forces i was able to invade because i own both sides of the uh bosphorus strait but I'm going to pull that back. So I start to think about going into the Caucasus, but I was like, no, I he could raid me, and then I could lose all sorts of stuff. So I did the Axis Snellized Bald Fist thing. Um, so I did resupply 97 with the battleship and cruiser. Moved everything forward. Just moving everything forward. Getting even Brazil. And then that's a transport ready to go. Uh, thought about that got rid of it um, and I did bring a uh, infantry uh, mech into Rostov I kind of didn't need to because I took out the I did, did decide last minute to take out the bomber nothing in Syria that was dumb so everything's got to go I don't want anything to be poached um, so the mech was kind of unnecessary but and then I needed a fighter two fighters to uh, invite a raid go ahead and hit the transport and see what happens um put two fighters down there to scramble even odds uh well you throw threes out through throw fours uh and then brought everything up except for i did take one fighter i didn't want to lose two but i was willing to risk one that uh really going to disable cripple the um, italians um, and then moved everything up and then I move a subs from um, Nova Scotia and just get a sub subnet going. So move the destroyer over to take the place of the French destroyer so I can convoy, convoy, convoy. We attack and I get a hit and he misses. And I land in uh, Archangel and you're going to take that fighter out, obviously. But I drew my anti-aircraft back to Yunnan 
and then cover that with anti-aircraft all, uh, all the way. Uh, my anti-aircraft never hit, but I believe in them. So, <laughs> three infantry in Persia, uh, three infantry in Egypt, um, and two infantry, one mech in South Africa. Uh, there we go. And, a, and another sub in the North Atlantic. As soon as I take out that fleet, I can start raiding the coasts big time. All right, and that ends me with $46. Uh, and then in India, that ends me with $13. So, no, $18, sorry, $18. All right, so let's do a recap for the British, for the British recap. Um, in Sean State, seven infantry, one artillery, one anti-aircraft, one anti-aircraft in Yunnan, one anti-aircraft in Sichuan, uh, two mech and one infantry in uh, India, two in infantry in West India. Oh, shucks, I didn't land those. I'll just edit that right now. Uh, I got to take everything out when you edit this this way. Uh, show current game, and I'll edit. You got to take it all out. And then you add the unit back in, British transports, and then two into Persia, or yeah, Iraq, Persia, whatever. Uh, two infantry there. Okay, uh, get it off that. By the way, never do combat in edit mode. It is really screwy. Okay, so 10 infantry in per, uh, Persia, 13 infantry, 6 mech, 2 tanks in northwest Persia, 1 mech in Rostov, uh, 5 fighters, 3 divers, 1 mech in Vola, Volgograd, in uh, Archangel, 1 fighter, in Iraq, 3 infantry, 3 mech, 1 artillery, 3 infantry, 1 artillery, 1 anti-aircraft in Transjordan, 90 Eight has a transport, four infantry, one tank, two fighters in Egypt, one infantry, one artillery in Anglo-Egyptian Sudan, one infantry in French Equatorial Africa, one inf two infantry in French Central Africa, two infant two mechs in Belgian Congo, one artillery in Tanganyika, one transport in off of uh, South Africa, two infantry, one mech in South Africa. Okay, and I screwed that one up too. Uh, I'm just going to leave that there. Uh, one infantry, uh, one t uh, transport in 87. Um, yeah. One destroyer in off of south southern France. Two battleships, three cruisers, four destroyers, one uh, aircraft carrier in 97. One sub in 104. One sub in 110. One sub in 109. 10 infantry, 1 mech, 5 anti-aircraft in London. And that is the exciting um, British turn 5. Rocket 36. Ouch.